Welcome to another session of this full demox tutorial that's for beginners to an advanced. Yes, um, if you haven't watched the previous sections of this course, I urge you to do so. The link is below. There's a playlist link below in the description. And also, you can also click on the link above this video. It's going to take you to the playlist so you can have access to all other sections and besides you should also subscribe and hit the notification bell more sections will be uploaded soon so you can have access to them so let's dive in hello everyone and uh, welcome to this video so this is a very optional uh, kind of a video which I am creating. This is only for those who are having a rooted Android device. So in this video, I will uh, guide you how to install Aircrack NG and how we can uh, get or how we can hack the Wi-Fi with the help of a rooted Android device. And here we'll use Aircrack NG. So what is Aircrack NG? Aircrack NG is a complete suite of tools to access Wi-Fi network security. It focuses on different areas of Wi-Fi security. We have monitoring mode. In monitoring mode, packet capture and export of data to text files for further processing by third-party tools. Attacking, that is relay attacks, deauthentication, fake access points and other via packet injection. We can also do testing that is checking Wi-Fi cards and driver driver capabilities that is capture and injection. Also we can crack WEP, WPA, PSK, WPA1 and 2. All tools are common line. All tools are command line which allows for heavy scripting. A lot of GUIs have taken advantage of this feature. It works primarily in Linux but also uh, Windows and OS X free BSD as well as Solaris and even Ecom Station 2 can also work there. So simply, uh, I'll quickly show you how you can uh, download this and uh, till the end, I'll uh, show you why this is not working in my, my Android device because it is not rooted. So if you have a rooted device, you can uh, easily try this uh, Aircrack NG and get the, uh, you know, Wi-Fi I mean you can uh, get Wi-Fi passwords as well we can get a uh, password for WEP WPA yes I have uh, done this I mean uh, for uh, checking whether our Wi-Fi is encrypted or not I have done this uh, with the help of Linux in my system so yeah in uh, if you have a system that is if you have a PC or anything I mean if you have a PC laptop computer whatever and inside that if you have a Linux uh, or Kali Linux installed then uh, you can uh, with the help of a network adapter you can easily use this uh, aircrack ng there but to use it in termux it is very important to you uh, important for us to have a uh, admin rights i mean the device should be rooted so if your device is rooted you can follow the steps till the end and uh, you will be able to you know get the wi-fi you know able to crack the wi-fi so let's begin So here uh, we'll type airmon ng and start wlan0 that is wireless lan so it will say that airmon ng is not installed so for that we'll simply type if config let's see wlan0 yes wlan0 is there since my device is not rooted there will be many problem you know you can you can see how many packages i need to install that is aircrack ng i need to first install so that so for that acha before that acha after that uh, that is pkg in root hyphen repo yes first of all we need to install this package thereafter we'll try to install pkg install airmon uh, that is aircrack ng will take some time depending on your internet speed but yes once this uh, first pkg that is repo 
which we are installing is done uh, then we'll try to install aircrack ng yes it is downloaded now next let's scroll up uh, yeah pkg install aircrack ng we'll just simply copy this command okay so before that just update and upgrade your termux it will take some time depending on the internet speed so today my internet speed is pretty low <laughs> so yeah, it will take near about some it's showing 20 minutes but i don't think so yeah i'll just uh, fasten up my installation process so once uh, this update and upgrade is done we'll install this pkg air mong uh, air crack ng So yeah, as I was uh, telling you about the Aircrack NG, it is a ne network software suit. It is consisting of a detector, packet sniffer, WEP, WPA, WPA2, PSK, cracker and analysis tool for 802.11 wireless LANs. It works with any wireless network interface controller whose driver supports raw monitoring mode and can sniff 802.11a. 802.11b and 802.11g traffic. The program runs under Linux, Mac OS, FreeBSD, OpenBSD and Windows. So uh, once this is done and if your Android device is rooted, after that you will be needing, uh, I mean you will be requiring a network adapter as well so since this my device is not rooted i won't be able to show you but yeah after this installation and aircrack ng is uh, successfully installed i'll uh, just give you acha in the uh, okay in the next uh, reading material you will find how to you know uh, start this uh, how to you know get this wi-fi password and how you can crack wpa pa2 wep uh, Wi-Fi passwords. So I'll just uh, you know after after uh, this installation process is done, you can go through the reading material. So if your device is rooted, you can follow the procedure. Also, keep in mind you need a network adapter. So this video is optional only for those who are having a rooted device. Okay, it's not this video is that. That's why in in the beginning only I told you this is just an optional video. So this is not for everybody. Will will definitely come. I'll definitely come up with a non-rooted uh, device like mine, which is not rooted. So how we can get uh, and crack the uh, Wi-Fi passwords? Okay, but this is only for those who are having a rooted device. So what are the features we have? Uh, so in the Aircrack NG software suit includes. Aircrack NG which cracks WEP keys. You know, we have PW attacks, WPA, WPA2, PSK using dictionary attacks. We have Airmon NG which places different cards in monitor mode. We have Airplay NG which is a packet injection for Linux, Windows, and we have Aerodum NG which is, which is packet sniffer which places air traffic into PCAP or 
files and shows information about network we have packet forge ng that creates encrypted packets for injection so we have various uh, features inside this aircrack ng so once we'll try this uh, airmon ng after this installation is done then also we have uh, buddy ng buddy hyphen ng it i mean it is the helper the helper server for is is side ng run on a remote computer okay we have airbase ng that incorporates techniques for attacking client as opposed to access as opposed to access points so there are various uh, uh what we can features we can say so yeah the uh, this uh, all the features will be listed in the reading material once this is in, this installation is done you can uh, easily go through uh these features so yeah make sure your device is rooted otherwise this thing won't work in your non rooted android device this is a very powerful tool which uh, many of the ethical hackers pen testers and also those uh, who are trying to you know check how much wifi uh, encryption is uh, i mean how much strong is the encryption so they use this tool that is aircrack ng software uh, in linux uh, i have used in uh, kali linux so yeah i have tried with the help of network adapter so most of the time i was able to you know crack it it also depends upon your uh, computer hardware so yeah very important you should have a network adapter which will help uh, your uh, kali and this software to you know get all the passwords so yeah it has been downloaded and the installation process has started oh just a second the update and upgrade has been done sorry uh, so yeah pkg install aircrack ng let's see installation done we'll try airmon ng let's see clear the screen type airmon ng this is one of the feature of aircrack ng airmon ng start wlan 0 as you can see it is showing run it as root so since uh, my device is not rooted so it won't be working in my device so if your device is rooted you can try this and rest of the procedure is there in the reading material you can go through it and uh, this is also a very optional uh, video so this is not for everybody okay so yeah you can try if you have a laptop uh, you can or a computer system you can try using kali linux inside your uh, system or uh, also you need a wifi adapter and you can easily you know crack most of the wifi passwords because uh, aircrack ng is very much uh, powerful tool and software so this will be a very useful thing for you to learn and also to help how to help, i mean to guide the encryption like if you feel or if you find any kind of a loophole in the encryption you can directly report or directly you know talk to uh, talk to the the encryption department like whosoever has uh, made the encryption if it is aes any any encryption it is there if you find any loophole you can directly contact to the uh, respective person or the company whosoever is responsible for that uh, encryption and you can report them so this is very useful tool for you and for everybody who is learning this because with the help of this we can crack various passwords also we can help uh, everybody to you know just do not misuse this tool and help everybody to understand how encryption is working help them like what are the loopholes and just you know uh help the society because this is a very powerful tool and we should not misuse it so yeah 
if you find any kind of uh, loophole directly report to the respective person or the company and it would be very useful for you as well as the authority so thank you so much once again do not misuse anything which which has been you know shown in this course because this is purely for learning purpose and uh, this is first of all it's a learning purpose and more importantly it is for the awareness like nobody can make whosoever is taking this course after the completion of this course nobody he or she can ever be fooled by anybody you know if your friend is giving you a app or a link anything just make sure you are not clicking any random links or downloading anything other than play store because play store you can trust play store because 90% to 90 98% you can trust in play store because most of the apps are scanned and you know uh, you know play store goes google goes through it thoroughly so yeah you can trust play store so this entire course is for learning purpose do not misuse any tool software because i am not responsible for any wrong or unethical thing you are doing this is only for learning purpose so thank you so much